First, each player needs to choose their hero. The warrior, mage, scout and healer each have their own role to play and have their own set of ability cards. Each adventure comes with its own set of dungeon and encounter cards. Don't shuffle them. Place dungeon card one on the table and read the encounter card one to everyone. This will tell you your objective. Some dungeon cards will have clues as to what lies in the next rooms. Decide which way you want to go and who's going to go first. This is important. Place the dungeon card for the direction you're moving in. Find and read the matching encounter card. Some rooms may appear empty, others may contain traps or treasure, and many rooms have nasty monsters. When you have to fight, place the monster counter on the tactical board opposite your party. If there are more heroes than monsters, you can gang up on a creature for attack bonuses. Roll two dice, add your skill and do the same for the opposing creature. The difference between the two totals is the amount of damage the loser takes. You can spend one of your luck points to re-roll all dice. Many ability cards can help you in combat. Each card only works once, so use them wisely. A creature is defeated if it takes damage equal to its stamina. Heroes that take this much damage are unconscious and can be healed. As you continue, you build up a map of the whole dungeon. Eventually, with luck, you'll complete your mission. Heroes will gain new ability cards. You can keep items you find along the way. And now you're ready for your next adventure.